Sony plays <laughs> with friends. Sony Interactive presents. Oh my lord. Oh. Oh, it's beautiful. Are they gonna do that weird thing? Are they gonna do that to us every time? You mean? Do yeah, that to that our hearts? That weird cinematic universe intro. I don't know. With Sackboy Cinematic Universe? They're gonna try. For every Sony game. They're really gonna put their all into is, making it a thing. Is this Sackboy's first non-Little Big Planet game? I think so. I don't know. Look at that big knitted title. That's me, that's me, that's me. Oh. Okay, I guess I'm, uh... Oh, look. <laughs> I'm... Wait. You're Greeno. Ooh, this is kinda cool. Okay. I'm Greenbo. Hey. And I'm Whitus. Oh, we can uh, do that whole thing where you hold down the button. You hold down the button. What oh, do you, mean? you, you can, can do that. Wait, yeah, L2 there you does go. that. You go, hey, help, help, please. Oh, you can do this. Oh, yeah, and you oh. can flail your. No, you can't. Never you mind. You can cross your arms back and forth. Yeah, I you can, can do this. You can do gang signs. I oh, can yeah. act like I'm petting a dog. Wait, where's the backhand? Oh, that's, I guess, just assigned to a button now. I changed my expression a second ago. I don't know how to change it back. Oh, it's the D-pad, I think. Really? Yeah. Oh. You press it multiple times to express, like, different levels of... Whoa. Okay. Ew, they got kid voices. You guys, I can't believe we're all playing with our sacks together. <laughs> Let me tell you I was counting down the first sack piece. joke in my mind. It's called the Imagisphere. The Imagisphere. And what we came up with was beanbags. <laughs> I hope you're ready to have your controller vibrate all the time in many different ways. This is the crazy mind of Sony. Our CEO spent years in isolation coming up with this very idea. Stretching his sack into every position imaginable. <laughs> The Ew. bat wing, the Don't monkey's say fist, the sack folk. the tumor, <laughs> the tumor, the brain. Sack boys, their like leader. Yeah, why does he get to be king? Just because he paints? Society looks. They ignore artists, if anything. Yeah, well, this is this is a nightmare world where your kind rules over the rest with an iron fist. This guy. Why does he have normal hair? I love this guy. Look at him. Oh, is this guy just a regular dude? I think that's a toddler oh, in an outfit. I honestly like his design a lot. That's cool. Yeah, I think he's cool. Sounds like a really good time. <coughs> you already have black lung. You might as well just enjoy it. So what you say? Kids, isn't smoking cool? <laughs> sack boy's on the wrong side oh of history. Oh no, he's vacuuming the sack. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that's that's a bad night at the ER. He, he vacuumed your he sack. He vacuumed the sack. No, mustachio. Well, you're just adorable. That's why I saved you for last. <laughs> No. If only Patchman were here to meditate with us. <laughs> He's in that photo. <laughs> Sackboy Adventures featuring Patchman. <laughs> what would Thoth do? He'd go to space! That's it! He'd go visit the hollow moon! <laughs> yeah, you can't forget your scroll when you go to space. You can't stop it! Why is he such a prick? I don't understand. Crossword will be mine! Yeah, you can have it. It's fucking stupid. Craft world. I thought it was the little big planet. <laughs> I'm gonna go some other place. You know, those are the exact circumstances by which Lance Armstrong traveled to the moon. <laughs> he, he was chased onto a ship by a fucking fabric guy. Yeah, the fabric guy with a giant vacuum arm. It was the president. He did that. <laughs> <laughs> And he was like, ah, oh, this is one small step away from Taft or whoever sent me here. <laughs> Vex. <laughs> oh, we're all really sad. Uh, it. Well, you're happy. Wouldn't, huh. it have been, wouldn't it have been Kennedy? <laughs> I don't know, history man. Oh, you can do a double jump. Look at that. I, 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 I feel like I'm going to be wrong, too. I live in the now, not the then. <laughs> not the where or the when. What do you guys when. think you're doing? I'm dancing, dude. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah! Ah! <laughs> Let's go. 
Uh, 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 uh. Wait, how do you do that, Chris? <laughs> you hold an L, L2 and hit up. Uh, 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 uh. 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 Fuck. Oh, come on, Tomar, we gotta go. Oh! <laughs> What's that button? Uh, right trigger. Uh -oh. What the fuck are these? I kind of just guessed and it worked. <laughs> I didn't know I was gonna straight up pick you up. Give me a you. What are we collecting? Is that we... the Twitch logo? That's just what we do. We collect, man. We just hoard. It's an admirable trait in video Ooh. games, much unlike real life, where if I hoard, people yell at me and have interventions. You're getting a high out of thinking that you've got fecal matter in your food. It's it's my last, it's my last blaze of glory. Do you remember Little Big Planet? Those were the days yeah. before all this. That was like a really overhyped thing that wasn't actually that great. Yeah, I was gonna say they made a big deal about it. And they put a lot of effort into it, and I never really thought it was fun. Yeah, I think no. it was. It was supposed to be like their big like Mario killer. I think was the idea. I thought and it was like a Mario Maker type game. Even yeah, before but, Mario but Maker, way before that was a thing. I mean, that was the idea, right? Where they were like, people will make their own fun. I don't know if it predated Minecraft or not, but it was definitely. Oh, I'm pretty sure it did. It was Ooh. definitely like around the same era where they were like, oh, let's give infinite levels. If you keep tapping circle, look what you can what do. What the fuck happened? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can get on me. Yeah, I just... Oh, you can just roll on your buddy? Yeah. Oh, here, let me try. That's pretty cool. Hey, look at me go. <laughs> I feel like these games yeah, always... You gotta, you gotta jump from dude to dude. Okay. Alright, this might, this might be the best game I've ever played. Okay, here we Ready? go. Ready? Yes! yes. <laughs> Yo! This is actually oh. pretty sick. Yeah. He wants let's, me to let's get see it. see how long till the novelty wears right. off. Right, yeah, I mean, that's true. <laughs> These games are always, like, way, way better with other people, though. Oh, for sure. But what did I get? I got a new costume piece. What? Wait, oh. I want that. How do you get that? I think it's a Yetis. I, I have no idea how you even wear the costumes. Ooh, what do I want to Yeah, you can probably on? customize your thing. I'm sure it'll teach us in time. Is that a cloud? Can I fuck that up? Ah! Hey, wait, how'd you do that? Uh, I jumped to press triangle. Oh. I don't know what triangle does otherwise, but if you press it in midair, you. Oh yeah, it's like it's like a it's like a face dive. Wait, is there a way up? Oh, okay. How'd you do that? It just <laughs> it just bounces you. There's like a bouncer is that a seed? there. Okay. Oh. We better collect all the things. I don't know what any of these the things that They're are. obviously integral. Yeah, no, I, I'm just habitually collecting shit because my stupid video game addled brain is like, this is shiny, I better go for it, but I have no idea what the value of any of it is. I just assume that it has value. And that's oh, half the journey, Tomar, is I'm watching a number tick up. Oh, my freaking sack head. You might as well just play a clicker game. I know, I know a few uh, people who play that cookie clicker game. That game is, uh, I recommend that anybody that wants to get acquainted with actually how stupid they are, <laughs> just play that game. <laughs> That's kind of fucking mean, but yeah, you're I right. I mean, it's true, right? Like, you yeah. don't realize, like, how sus susceptible your stupid lizard brain is yeah, to no. just watching a number click I, up. I know I am. Look, I've played enough clicker games. I, there's even clicker uh, games I still occasionally play, just like when I'm bored and I, and I can't be bothered to get invested in something. I think the interesting thing about Cookie Clicker is it doesn't even have the pretense of being good. Like, it's just like, it's a cookie, click it, you dumb asshole. And then you do it, and then it's like, okay, you you saw the number move, now you're addicted, and it's just like, oh, I thought, I right. thought Cookie, at least the, the Cookie Clicker I remember playing, I felt like you got all the content you needed within like an hour anyway. Well, yeah, I mean, that's kind of the point, though, is like, I, I feel like a lot of games try to build themselves on Cookie Clicker, and people are like, I'm having fun with this, but you're not really having fun with it. It's just like, Whew. cookie clicker, you know what I mean? It's Scarlet. I don't like her, not one bit. With pure creative energy I lost this spirit. eye in a great war. I've seen much death. <laughs> now go to the bubblegum junction. <laughs> yes, they gouged it. Yes, it hurt. Yes, but yes, magical yes, adventure yes, awaits. I have How come she only talks to Chris's sack and our sacks just have to wait, in, wait off camera? Because our sacks are shorn and underneath a circumcised <laughs> dick. 
To be like acknowledged, you have to be a brown hairy sack. I see. Green sacks need not apply. I see. Or shiny. And white sacks are uh, too afraid to speak up for fear of being perceived a certain way. If she was real, I'd pick out her hair individually. <laughs> I'd feed her worms. <laughs> I'd dye her brown. Now oh, she's dead now. I'm glad. Follow me, guys. I know what we're doing. Oh, this is just like in uh, Little Big Planet. Yes. All right, it's good. Little Big Planet was good. I remember now. It was not bad, but it yeah, I'm it kidding. definitely had like a. <laughs> I remember I made a whole level in it. I just remember I made like a giant like dick rocket. Yeah, you have fifty trillion other people. <laughs> yeah, I made I made like this this creature that was like a dick with eyes. Oh, what? wait, why do I have the trophy? My oh wait, trophy. we take it from each other. My trophy. No, <laughs> man. Tomar wins once again. Why, well, boys? Leave me alone. Yes. Anyway, I made like a big like dick creature that like when you grabbed onto it, it just fucking rocketed you into space. <laughs> Those were good levels. Yeah. I'm sure there were a zillion trillion of them. I remember around that time there was all these like online articles being like, Someone remade Final Fantasy VII in Little Big Planet, and they acted like it was good every single time. Then you'd play it for like a second and be like, okay, sucks. It just goes to show how desperate most game journalists are to just yeah. get a story out. <laughs> it's true. I mean, I guess that's all journalists. Dude, but... it was like this week, there were like there was a whole article about how the main and black's feet are now like black and stinky. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, in, in what in what context? It's like the maiden in black's feet and demon souls are now filthy. Like that's the title. Was that what? Was it was it praising that fact or uh, reprimanding it? I was doing neither. Is it the was maiden in black it. normally barefoot? I never even she is thought barefoot, about her feet. But now her feet are black and soot covered stink. Oh, you fucking liar! I've never thought about her feet. I didn't I consider haven't. taking a smell. You're not getting anything over on us, little man. <laughs> This is why I've never thought about sack folk. I just don't want to deal with this shit. Yeah, I would hate to live yeah, this in this guy, fucking world. This guy world. is vomit-inducing. He's an eight ball. He's really asymmetrical, and it's just... It's not for me. I meant that literally, by the way. His head is an eight ball. It looks like, oh, yeah. his, it looks like his beard is, like, hanging out of his mouth. I hate that. <laughs> I don't like him at all. I honestly hope he dies. Okay, what's this? You guys are such posers. You're supposed to be bland and average like everyone else. What are you, the fucking bad guy of, uh, some children's movie? <laughs> I so need you to be average and boring! Everyone must be the same. That is my plan. You can't get away with this! I want these three- Oh, but I already have! <laughs> God, I want to murder him. You will one day. It's a it's a fun design, but I really hate it. All right, I'm I'm ready. <laughs> I like I like I don't think it's objectively bad. I just don't like it. It's fun, but I despise it. Huh. here, stand on the feet with us. It's funny. Okay. I suppose feet are kind of funny. I suppose that's uh yeah. pretty cool. Cool feet. Wait, they spell feet wrong. That's so stupid. Oh no, we were promised one thing and delivered another. I see some feet. Thank God. Okay, there we Ooh. go. We're fine. Thank, Phew. thank God this level will still be funny, am I right? Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's go explore feet. <laughs> uh, if you get killed by these stupid... Yeah, if this apple murders man. you, then I will never respect you again. Fuck you, frog. Cool, yeah. Hitting these guys makes them come out, I guess. Can you believe this frickin' music? Ooh, la 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 la! Oh. Hey, I'd appreciate it if you stopped hitting my bum, okay? Um, I know... I don't know where you get off, but that's not okay in this day and age. I understand, and I value your feelings. Thank you. That's so easy to do, right? Like, you could have put up a big stupid fight, drug that out... Uh, Take note, fuck listeners. You. Yeah, that guy had a lot of nerve spinning like that. Like, what is this guy's value to society? This worm? This fucking this stupid big square idiot. worm. Yeah. He seems oh, like the kind of guy the world prick. would be better off without. What do you think? Oh, no. What do you think we'd do oh. without him? Hey, oh, that here. did kill me? Oh, no, you're dead. Whoops. Oh, no, you're back. Uh, Wait, are you? 
Are we ever really back in this crazy world, Chris? Not really. This crazy, crazy world. Where is Tomar? Yeah, it just made me vanish. Did you I press don't know. start or something? Do you fucking return? I don't want to live without Tomar. I don't want to live a life without Tomar. It just wouldn't feel complete. No. Oh. There, I it guess that's what you do to it. rescue your dude as you go to these things. Ah. Enough Ooh. of the spinning. Wait, so I, I've had it with this rotation. <laughs> oh shit, we're fighting a faker. You know that guy has one-fourth of an orgasm every time he does that? <laughs> How did you know? Uh, well, there are three of us. <laughs> and, uh, he's just like one- just one are quarter more. Are you saying you felt part of it yourself? Yeah, we all feel a little bit of it. Lyle <laughs> likes to call himself the Mancubus, right Lyle? Yeah, because I'm full of mank. What does that mean? <laughs> it's like a succubus, but a man? I don't know. No, I call myself a fuckubus, because I love to fuck. You're a cuckubus. No, that's my friend. He watches while I fuck. <laughs> <laughs> There's a monster that's just the cuck. <laughs> the cuckubus? The cuckubus. The rocks. Yeah, every time you have sex in front of him, he steals a little bit of your soul. You steal a little bit of his soul. <laughs> that's actually kind of cool. I feel like that's a good lore. Yeah, that'd be- that'd be like a good creature to have. Yeah, we need to start writing the background of the Cuckubus before someone <laughs> yeah. steals the idea. So someone- like a demon comes in to like, terrorize you, he accidentally lets his girlfriend in through the portal and you fuck her in front of him. <laughs> then you steal a little bit of his soul. And you become like, a powerful demon god. Yeah, hey, that was so fucking fun, oh my god. That would definitely be like, a good premise for like, a shitty, uh, college humor skit. I was gonna say, like, a hentai or something. <laughs> Both. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, we all have weird little umbilical cords when you get a new costume piece. I'll kill you! <laughs> Why were these guys so sold on Pat- yeah, What's his it. name? Patchman. Sackboy. Sackboy? Why didn't Sony just buy Crash Bandicoot? Because didn't Naughty Dog sell it to fucking Ubisoft or whatever? Uh, Activision, Why I didn't think. Sony just buy it? It was I, their thing anyway. I'm not sure. I actually don't know who was making Crash Bandicoot games between, uh, Activision and, um... Because th wasn't there so- who made, like, Crash Bandicoot hugs Neo Cortex and he goes, Ugh! What are you talking about? The fucking game where they roll together. Oh, Twin Sanity? Yeah, who made that? Um, I don't know. I really don't know. I forget. I just yeah. know Traveler's Tales did the fourth one. A likely story from someone whose dad made that game. I don't want you to tell people that. Okay. <laughs> Cut that out then. Cut out that Chris's dad made that game. <laughs> don't you dare forget it. I got editor. bullied enough as a kid for that or shit. We all know. What the hell is this crap? We don't have enough iridescent eggs to fucking unlock that yeah, 20 th door. I think we just gotta go to the next level. I know it defies logic, but this... hear me out, guys. Okay. Up for grabs. All right, all right, all right. All right, all right. I love being sick, man. Wowee, we got quite a crowd here. All right, all right, all right. That, that's how you're gonna start. All Seth. the ladies, get out. All the men. All right. All right, all right. Come on in. Hey. <laughs> you know the difference between women and men? Women are all like, and eh, men are all like, eh. <laughs> <laughs> I want to start a club just so I can roll reverse that whole thing where they only let a bunch of girls in and keep all the fat ugly dudes out. Oh yeah, like like start a dudes night. A fat ugly dudes night. Yeah, the sweatier the dude, the more uh, one dollar your drinks are. We can all just <laughs> hang out and play Metal Slug 3 in the bar. That would, that would actually rock. I'd go to that. Is that the ultimate masculine activity, Metal Slug 3? Yeah, actually. That is just fun. It is just fun. And if a girl walks in, you've got full permission to just, like, grab her by the jaw and rip it off. <laughs> Jeez. I think that's fair. Just for one bar to do that, out of all the other bars that don't do that. Yeah. That's still a good average, if you think about it. Do you remember that bar that, like, it was all over, like, BuzzFeed and shit? They're like... Oh wait, can you grab this guy by the tail? I don't know. I look like you can. I don't know, Interrupto. Anyway. Sorry. <laughs> but do you remember there was a bar that was like... This bar has millions of colored balls like a plague pen, and adults are loving it. 
Uh, yeah, that's, I don't remember that, but that's weird. <laughs> but yeah, then, the, the uh, weird, like, adult camp and adult daycare stuff. I'm pretty and... sure those bars are gone because after, like, one day, there was probably, like, shit and puke just embedded between all the balls. I feel like that would attract a very specific type <laughs> of person. I think you're right. <laughs> I still want to try it out. I want to try shitting in a ball pit. <laughs> I feel like Sackboy's Adventure would be cooler if there was more like beheadings and like flayings and Yeah, I wanna see I wanna see blood. I wanna see gore. Oh! I wanna just see his little like threads get pulled apart and like watch him scream and, and like I don't know. Maybe some more cool stuff. That's freaking sick, man. I want Sackboy to have a tragic oh! past. I want oh. I want well, Sackboy well. to say my whole village was killed. Well it kinda was actually. Well yeah, actually he kinda did. But I want I want him to really feel the weight of it. He's like running around and yeah, grinning Yeah, he can't know that they're right all just now. sitting around in a vacuum bag. He has to think they're all dead. Or or they have to just actually be dead. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, hey, my friends! We're all back! Let's read P and something soup. Oh yeah, they're like tiny and shit in a real man's world. It's not really a real world, though, is it? Like, yeah, I like, know, and that's not something- Grab his tail, grab his tail, yank it back! Sackboy never yeah. grapples with that, that a child could tear his arms off if he wanted. And I feel like he should. Yeah, jump on me, sweetie. Yes! Wow, you used you teamwork. It. There should be a thing in Toy Story where all the toys crawl down Whee! Andy's throat and suffocate him and he dies. I think, uh, Toy Story 4 should have focused more on that. I think at least once a toy should have taken a human life in those movies. Yeah. I want Al from Al's Toy Barn to come back. I want there to be real-life consequences in the Toy Story. Oh! Yeah, we made it. What the f*** is this thing? You son of a bitch, come oh. out here, coward. <laughs> you invisible bitch! Do these guys kind of have like a little Yoshi float? Yeah, they do. Yo, love. Yeah, what's up? If the invisible woman showed you her tits, um, would you still get horny knowing that she did it, even though you couldn't see it? Were they... so she's invisible at the time. Is the idea that we're supposed to jump on these guys to get bounced up yeah. to the top? Maybe. She's invisible at the time. So she's invisible and she goes, hey, I was totally oh, yeah. naked around you. Is that, that kind she of the premise? She whispers in your ear, I'm showing you my tits right now. And oh yeah, that's She that sounds probably, really hot. Yeah, if That she, alone would probably... That yeah. would do it, yeah. If she's yeah. getting horny from it, yeah. Okay. Her invisibility powers go away and now she's just like... A fat version of you. Oh, that got really horny. <laughs> <laughs> Not because I'd be attracted to a fat version of me, but because I know that I could be less attractive, and and then I, that would make me grateful for not being. Yeah, exactly. Gratitude's and then, your big turn on. <laughs> yeah. Well, and then I could look at myself in the mirror and go, "That's hot by comparison to fat me," and oh. then I get horny. Okay. And, it, and it still sounds like the Invisible Woman, right? Uh, it's, no, the second she's, like, uh, visible, her voice goes 20 octaves whee! deeper. <laughs> Look, I, at this point I'm determined to get horny in this scenario, so I think I can make it work. No! Oh! <laughs> Spotlight send me! Spotlight send me! What the Ooh, hell? Why do you me? get that? Yeah! It's not fair. I put in way more fucking effort than you, bro. I put in the- I was on the grind, the, man! The numbers don't lie, bruh. I'm on the grind, I put in the hours. Oh, that's the first level we actually bothered collecting orbs, I guess. Oh, yeah. Whatever those are for. Soaring? Were we not collecting them before? Well, there's no- we don't have them on any of the levels we've done previously. I've just been seeking shiny objects like a magpie. So if we haven't been collecting them, that's not through any fault of our own, Whoa. I don't think. Ooh, a floppy lamp! Oh we god, to if go we get a wish! That, that... Give the it a genie. good rub! Genie, come out show us your floppy. Yeah. We did it! Oh, well, you killed us. Now we are imprisoned for oh, all eternity. Oh, you that motherfucker! Is, that is the genie, isn't oh, it? Oh, no, he's not. He's just a guy playing a prank. Wow, I think we're doing pretty good, honestly. I think this is uh, about as good as you can do, in fact. Time? You know what would make us even do better? Is a fourth player like you, the viewer. <laughs> Edit in a fourth player. <laughs> Put him in the bottom corner. You deserve a and make him have lots of fun. What? You didn't even have me? Oh my god! <laughs> now it's like he's really here. Oh man. He's coming right for us. Oh, <laughs> uh, cut off his fucking ears. <laughs> so he can't hear the things we say about him. God, oh, look, what a this. bit. I think honestly the dynamic has slowed down considerably since that guy showed up. <laughs> he ruined the channel. 
Let's see. What's his name, though? Write in the comments what your name is, and we'll blame you for everything. Okay, Lyle. Russell Sprouts, yeah or nay? Yeah, they're fine. What if you know they're slightly burnt? Uh, yeah, they're fine. You're right. I don't like them like crispy. They're weird when they're like boiled, but if you've ever had them baked, they're pretty good. Why are we talking about Brussels sprouts? Because there's Brussels sprouts. Oh, okay. I, 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 yeah. I'm, oh, these I'm, things. Uh... I'm done with some roasted sprouts. Oh, oh, that's what we were doing. That makes sense. Ah, oh. What up, what up, what up? I wanted to cast those things to their graves, and now I'm here. Guys, I'm right behind you. Okay, I'm in front. Oh, oh fucking God. Christ! Whoa! That's evil. That's, That's fucking scary. Disgusting. It's like a, I thought it was a pastry. You can't do that. I thought it was something you bounced on. I thought it was gonna be fun, man. I thought I was in for some whimsical joy, and I became fucking prey to a to a horrible insectoid. Bouncing on cock, yeah or nay? Uh, if you think, well, I think people should do it to me. I don't think that um. I don't think I should do it. You're just the frickin' pussy. No, that's what should be bouncing on cock. <laughs> pussy? Here, yeah. I, someone try to uh, jump on my head to trigger this guy. Here, Tomar, ah, no. you're the sacrifice. <laughs> okay. Oh, you got it, okay. I think now we just have to throw one of those dudes into that Is that a button? Thing. Yeah, I think that's a button. Yeah! I got it, I got the key! Despite your best efforts, you fucking apex predator. Fucking bitch. I can't believe they start off as those fucking... Yeah, we get to see these things whole terrible oh, no. life cycle. I fell, I fell, I'm stupid. And the end of the life cycle is me. The tone of this game is making me sleepy. Really? Yeah, everything's too comfy looking. Well, I mean, it's not a bad thing. It, it just, just makes you feel warm makes and me, soft. Yeah, I want to lie down in this world. Yeah, I could see it. It does kind of have like a little bit of like a... Like There's a mom's... Place. Uh, oh, it's me! Like yeah. a mom's living room sort of vibe. Yeah, Wait, what if we down. what if we each pull on one of these? Does that I wonder if that triggers something? Oh yeah, maybe something. that is what that. There's multiple balls. Ooh. Yeah. Uh oh. We're yeah, we're extracting the the beads from that prolapse. You ever get paranoid extracting that's going to happen to your testicles? We got that. Well, let me pick up this screw. Screw you. <laughs> Dude. Oh, fuck, gonna... Toma, you are right into It's me. pretty brutal, oh, man. Oh, Toma! Oh, I fucking love being sack boy. Look at me go- What? Wait, uh, how'd you do that? I don't know. I, uh, I've always wanted to do that! If you click in the right and left trigger, you get taken away? Why? What's the point? Is you that click the quit? In the, the right- wait. What? Does that just, like, end my game if I go all the way up? I don't know. It, it seems to just- Make it easier to like follow other players if you get like stuck. Wait, the right and left trigger is how you're doing or, that? Uh, no, click, click, click them in. Or three and or L3. Click, oh, click in. Yeah, dead. sorry, not the triggers. The sticks. I became a corpse trying to do that. That's okay. Everyone will become a corpse one day. Everyone will become a gray little skeleton. When is the butler from Tomb Raider going to get his own game? Dude, when I was a kid, I used to think butler was the funniest word on the fucking planet. <laughs> <laughs> It is now that you mention it. I buckled for <laughs> the beetles. Butler. <laughs> it's like you assler. Yeah, it's good. You dickler. I kind of like assler now. <laughs> there probably was a point in my life where I would. I think call we just want to go back to the beginning of the level where the where the keyholes oh, were. Yeah. Oh, there was a keyhole. Yeah. This away. Yeah, you assler is a pretty good one. It's like the one slur. <laughs> the assler. The yeah. one slur versus the assler. Oh, we did it. I know who's winning that fight. The cuntsler. The the, it's obviously the one slur who sings Biggering. <gasps> Biggering? Big yeah. Big uh, oh my god. These things cannot yeah, roll I don't know how you found domain. that, Chris. Like, I feel like I saw- like I saw a video randomly the other day. It's like, the song that would have saved the that Lorax. That was exactly where I saw it. I, yeah. It was like a really good clickbait and I clicked on it yeah. and I saw it. <laughs> and I was like, you know what? That is a pretty cool song. Yeah. Did the person make up a song? No, there was this cut song from the yeah. Lorax. It's like Ed Helms rocking out about like sort of going from his humble beginnings to like building his big company. Yeah, and you know that greedy. part of the Lorax where he's like, How bad can I breathe? Yeah. They, that was just like the original version of that song. It was kind of more dark and spooky. This is a knitted night. Okay. He has exactly as much sentience as you, but he is little, and I control everything about him. <laughs> Why is this bitch not helping? 
Yeah, she just kind of talks and does nothing of value. She I'm seems like she's more powerful than you, and yet you are tasked with saving the world from this asshole. She basically just made like a little plush of Hitler in this world. Yep. This person literally wants to kill you, and I made a fun, festive little toy of him. They don't even bother humanizing him at all. You're going to love seeing my little Gaddafi and my little Mussolini that I've made. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe he has, like, some decent intentions we're just not aware of. Maybe in his world he's a hero and he's a really cool guy. Yeah. Who, Vex, or...? Yeah, Vex. We barely know anything about him. We're just taking this lady's word that he's this awful guy. Are you saying that this is a mat? We watched him vacuum up our friends. Yeah, yeah but, but, but that was just from the perspective of a sack person. Tomar, like, yeah. if anybody fucking vacuumed you up on this earth, there is nothing anyone could say that would stop me from getting to their throat. You know this. Uh -huh. History's written by the sack boy victors. That's you sweet. Know. <laughs> just saying, if a big fucking vacuum. Like, I would hope that, that if a big fucking vacuum sucked me out of this room, you couldn't be reasoned out of it. Like, oh, maybe it was the right thing to do. But that's in my that's in my context. I guess I just have trouble sympathizing for, like, a yarn person. Why is that, Tomar? Because they're, like, voodoo people? That's true. If you poke him... Because they're yarn. If you poke him, we feel the pain. Yeah, I can't really get too invested in this stupid yarn fella. How does a voodoo work? If a voodoo... If someone makes a really shit voodoo if doll... You, if you do a voodoo... If yeah, you spit you do, on the voodoo doll and then you kick the voodoo doll, you get kicked by a ghost. But let's say, let's say somebody makes a voodoo doll and it's of me, oh, yeah. but it looks nothing fucking like me. Like they did a, bit, a bad job. Yeah. Does it still work? If they have your DNA in it, yeah. Yeah, I think all that matters is that it's got like your hair or something on it. Okay, but what if they screw up my hair? Because my hair is a very specific style. No, I mean literally like a piece of your hair. Yeah, they, they, they take a hair and they shove it up the voodoo doll, and now it has your DNA in it, so you're fucked. As long as it's just got like four leg, four, two arms, two legs, and a head. What if they get my hair, but it's my what hair from fuck? like five years ago? Unless, Does it I guess still unless, work? I guess if you made a voodoo doll for like a paraplegic, it, w it wouldn't need as many limbs. Do you have to stick dolls, little Hot Wheels in the side of it. Do voodoo dolls expire? Like, uh, if my if my hair gets too old, does it go bad? If your hair turns gray in the voodoo doll, then your real hair turns gray. Uh, Chris, I think that's you that's not in the... Oh, yeah. ...in the Wonder Ball. Oh, I wonder, wonder... Didn't those get banned because children were eating the toys within? <laughs> I've never I, heard of it. I heard something like that. I don't know if that's true or if they just weren't selling well. Are, they, ki are Kinder Eggs in America or no? Or was like, that like I, I a thought, thing? I thought it was Kinder Eggs that got banned, if anything. It I, might have been both. I thought I've seen King Kinder yeah. Eggs here recently, though. Maybe they got unbanned. Yeah, I feel like they did. Oh. We got we got over it eventually. Did we just decide it's not the end of the world if a child eats a toy? Because that yeah. shit happens all the time. We just decided that was natural selection. We're just bullying this poor thing. Eventually we'll have a world without children who eat toys if we stop, like, oh. intervening all the time. <laughs> If we made a voodoo doll of Lyle, and we kept at it, like, knitting onto his cock, would his cock grow more in real life? That's the question of the century, isn't it? Also, if you gave me, like, okay, let's say you, you made a voodoo doll of somebody. Yeah. You give it, like, four legs. Okay. And you poke one of those legs, what happens? You spread a new leg and it gets hurt. I say we knit a voodoo doll, and then rub out your, your tribal tattoo on the doll. What do you mean, rub it out? Oh, like ta tattoo remove the oh, doll? Use it, yeah. use it as like cheap tattoo remove. <clears throat> See, now that's p practical. Yeah, or can you make a voodoo doll of yourself and like suck its ass and <laughs> <laughs> feel like you're getting your ass sucked? Is that what you're Your testes would just fly out of your ass. <laughs> it's too much force. Yeah, it's like as if a giant person did that to you, I guess. Boy I saved you guys, I pushed you. What if you have a voodoo doll and you bite off its mouth? Or you tear off the arm that you're using to tear it off. Um... I don't know. Also, what if you swallowed your own voodoo doll? That's like a weird paradox. Yeah, that's that's kind of what I was getting at, is if you tear off your own arm on the voodoo doll... Oh, I guess doll, that's a bonus level. I kind of want to bore my voodoo. Oh, I think oh. we want to feed him these soon-to-be exploding carrots. Alright. I guess, or they're probably supposed to be peppers, huh? It's kind of impossible not to get it in there. It's kind of like this is a game for babies. We Don't play. say that. We Don't play games that. for babies all the time, and we have a way harder time with it. Guys, it's not a game for babies. It's set on the box, 45 and over. 
<laughs> oh yeah, I thought that was really unusual that it said that. I kind of do wish that there was like age ratings for like 80 year olds and no one else could see that shit. <laughs> Just like the <laughs> ultimate Cause taboo. then old people would at least have something going for them. Yeah, something to look forward to. You could finally see NC-85 movies. Yeah, like, I, I feel like old people should just be allowed to do heroin and math and shit. I think that would be cool. Also, yeah, NC-85, just, just <laughs> no, no holds barred. Cause I do feel like there is stuff that's made for adults where it's like, oh, are we sending the right messages? Like, what am I for? Like, just fucking. Yeah, at a certain just age, show it's me like something you're, fucked up. It's I don't impossible care. for you to be influenced by anything new anyway, so they might as well just show you whatever. Yeah, or or you're not you're not powerful enough to do anything evil anymore. You know, when you're like 85. <laughs> oh, fair enough. You can. I guess you can try. I just figure but... if you're not evil now, I don't think a movie's gonna make you evil when, once you're 80. Yeah, that's. That's kind of my point. Yeah. Either it can't influence you, or you're not powerful. Oh, fuck! Ah! You guys are silly. <laughs> I, don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why that surprised and scared me. <laughs> you being surprised by it scared me. I hate these Yeti fellas. They just need to go. Ah! Oh, fuck. Oh, God. oh, you made it over the gap! <laughs> oh, that killed all of us! Oh, wait, no, I'm alive. Wait, how? Chris, don't die, don't die! <laughs> I won't. There you, that's our revival square. Whee! That's Circle. our life. Ain't you proud of me? Yeah. Oh. Uh... I like when games have little vocals in the music. I like it when games have gameplay and like music and art and graphics. That's a, that's a pretty uh, that's a pretty unique opinion. I know. That's you're why always, people watch me. You're always such a contrarian, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh, is this a boss fight? Oh shit! Oh, he's moment. having fun. Kill yeah, him. He played that fucking mist music. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Let's do what he does and just keep rolling. That's oh, a yeah. good idea. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Oh, my God. Ah! Help. I'm just going to keep going. Yeah, keep going. Oh, this Whoa. is kind of fun. <laughs> Why couldn't the whole game just be this? Running from this guy specifically? Yeah, it's oh, the God. most fun I've ever had in my life. Uh-huh, motherfucker. Oh, God. They beat me up and killed me. Yeah, well, that's what happens when you don't pay attention, dude. Yeah, keep your eyes on the prize, Tomar. Here I am. Oh, okay, he's dead now. He cool. fucking died. We Woo. found a Rubik's Kubel. He knew that this was gonna be his last roll when he took it. I did it. Lol, you voice sec boy, right? Yes, every single time. That's cool. How come oh, you- Oh, look what? at me. How come you keep getting that? It's not fair. <laughs> Why can't we all get it once? <laughs> I participated, did I not? I don't even know what it is that determines that. <laughs> if it's just the raw amount of yeah, like you were random. Yeah, dead at the end of that. Yeah, I survived the whole way through. Well, it's clearly not based on skill. <laughs> <laughs> I want to eat a donut. Tomar has hidden powers that even we cannot comprehend. Do you guys want to make a pun? Yeah, let's make a pun. Make a. Let's make create a the newest pun. All Are right. you ready? All right, a skateboarder who who can't stop scraping his knee. Is called a. Can't <laughs> use <laughs> what? Come on, man. Uh, 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 uh. I can't think of anything. Uh, Tony. Would Fuck. he be called like a? I don't know. Like if you called him like a scraped border, does that even count as a <laughs> pun? Does that even count as a pun? I don't that even works. know. That works. Yeah, that was. Ugh. I was trying to like work the word knee into Tony Hawk, but I couldn't. I couldn't figure out something with Hawk that rhymed <laughs> with falling down. Let's see. Yeah, Tony. Tony Hawk. Toes. Toes knee. Toes knee. I don't know. A scrape border is probably better than any any route that that leads to. I'm honestly proud of you, dude. You're going places, kid. Who's rapping, dude? Oh, this is that fucking. Yeah, this is up. They they just straight up threw Uptown Funk in. I cause... wonder if that's gonna get us copyright claimed if we fucking have Uptown Funk playing. Editor, put the uh, Arkham Asylum soundtrack under this. I wonder if this is synced up to the music. Because it looks like it's bouncing to, like, a certain tempo. It is. Yeah, it's I think of, it is. It's sort of a bummer that we're missing out. Uh, make this screen all scary and black and white. See, now it's kind of cool. It's like a different tone, see? Willkommen. You know how, like, uh... <laughs> That's really weird that everything is, like, bouncing in time. Yeah. <laughs> now this is just, like, uncanny. 
So uh, that was an awkward silence. Do, yep. you, do you want to comment on that? This or? is a this, this is, is a real this is, good uh, yeah, this good level without the music. He's probably dancing to it. <laughs> it's kind of funny without the music. <laughs> yeah, it is. Everyone's having such a good time all on their own. It's like that guy who went to a fire festival and he's just like dancing outside and everyone else sitting down. They have uh, well, the guy who could have fun at fire fuck. festival must be a real go getter. He's like, "Fuck it, dude, we're here. Come on, let's go." And everyone's just like, "Uh, I'm scared." Uh, I'm still kind of bummed that I spent five thousand dollars to be here. I would love to have gone yeah. to that. That guy probably died of dehydration. Really? Yeah. Why? It would have been so fucking funny just you to see it. You would have been so mad though. I at know, the time. but it, it'd be such a worth it to be there kind of thing. It's like legendary. I guess. <laughs> I don't regret not being at Fire Festival. <laughs> but you get to have like bread and cheese and you get to like you get to live in like a yeah, you get $2000 to... like portable tent. You get to see the tent. Yeah, I I do like how quickly that devolved into a Lord of the Flies situation <laughs> yeah. where people were fighting over pillows and shit like that. Apparently there was wild dogs and shit. That's like hilarious. Like running in and just <laughs> What a level. <laughs> Everyone, everyone's having fun but us. They have these things where they're like silent clubs or something where you're just supposed to bring fucking headphones and... Just... Oh yeah, I've done silent disco before. That's I think real? It, I think it's fun. I've... I think it would just be weird to fucking look at. <laughs> yeah, yeah, when you don't have headphones on, sure. <laughs> That's really weird. I'm not shitting on it, I just think it would be a strange thing if you didn't know what that was to just encounter. Oh, uh, how cool would it be to go to the club and just listen to, like, One Winged Angel while everyone else just be a fucking loser? They would have no idea that that's what you were listening to if you were dancing the same way. Yeah, you'd I just be bopping, you'd be like, I can't oh, imagine I dancing. Dance I've never danced to, to One Winged Angel, I don't even know how that would work. You stomp your feet and kick over buckets dude, of milk dude, and shit. Dude, dude, dude. <laughs> it's got a good just tempo imagine, for it's, it. It's like a march tempo, it's not really a dance song. Dun, dun. You just Stomp your feet and break your ankle while you do it. 